Hey guys, welcome back to the shop. So today we're going to have a look at the maple top. Now as you can see, I have a flame maple top, book matched. Uh, if, what does it mean book match is literally a piece of wood cut in half and book matched like that. That's why it's like an open book and you have two mirror images and that's why it's called book matched. So basically this was like this and I cut it from the middle and I opened it and chose the best side. Which for me, I think this is the best side of it. As you can see, from alcohol, it has a nice figure to it. Especially I wanted to keep it's this area where it's a lot. If you want more information about book matching, I ha I will have a, li a video linked somewhere here, or here, or maybe here, or even to, to the side. We'll see. But I have an, a really nice video about book matching the hard way, unplugged, without any power tools or whatsoever. And some of you may find it a bit, a bit hilarious, to be honest. So. Mala, how to prepare this? So basically what I'm going to do Yeah, it's rough It's not even nothing, nothing I already machined flat this face This is going to be glued This face is going to be glued on the blank The mahogany blank So before gluing that I want to cut the profile of the guitar, leaving about um, five, five mil of extra material for the final cut, and mill the alignment hole for the body. And then, obviously gluing up to the body blank. So there is no alignment pins on this, I'm just going to put it in, align the center line of the top with the CNC bed and just pop four screws here and this won't go anywhere. So let's do that. Okay guys, let's have a look at the tool pads regarding this maple top. So for the maple top tool pass, I'm going to use body 4 since it has a continuous parameter. And in my setups, body 4 contour, in the drop down menu, I have already the maple top oversized contour. Now this tool pad uses a quarter inch flat router cutter and I'm leaving 5 millimeter overhang. This is the router cutter diameter, and as you can see, it's not touching the parameter of the body. And I'm going down, in my case, the thickness of the stock of the maple top, which is 9 millimeters. <laughs>
Okay, and after that, I have an alignment hole, this one, for gluing, uh, for aligning the top with the body blank when it comes to glue up. So the maple top is exactly where I want it to be. It's like one of those puzzles. Ah. And that's the top. No, that hole. Let me get this. That hole goes in this hole, the alignment, and I use, usually I use a cocktail stick. It's exactly two mil. And that goes there. But the back is just a matter of aligning the center line with the body blank center line. And the body will be like this. But before that, I want to give a light sand at the faces to remove mostly these lines. But before I need to bring this down with a plane and then sand everything down. I really need to change my sender. <sighs> no. To clean up. Okay, so now I have the faces ready for glue up on both. But before that, I wanted to mask a couple of things before gluing up the body with the top, especially here where I where the pick up wires pass and here and these holes because I don't want glue to go inside and masking tape it's thin enough so it won't affect the glue up this is the same trick when you glue a fretboard, you mask the truss rod, so there's no glue going into the truss rod. Same thing. I don't worry if, if glue goes into the pickups and they control gravity. I can easily route everything out. But, but this would be a bit critical. Even these, I can accept these two. The, the post, I can give them another pass, but that will be another extra step and that will consume time. And the purpose for me, the purpose of a CNC, 
is to save time. Now, cocktail stick, actually, it is better both inside the top. Glue and brush, or if you prefer fingers, but I do prefer brush. So guys, I think that should be enough. The more you put, obviously the better, but this is what I have. So guys, thank you very much. For now, I'm going to leave this overnight. So it sets up. And then after that, in the next episode, we can continue with some other stuff face up the top because it's too thick at the moment there are machining on top and then when we have the top at the distance we want around six millimeters we can flip the work flip the, the body blank over and level up the back because it still needs to go down a couple of mil from the back and then finishing up the routes at the back for the neck recess and then sanding and finish and staining no i'm going to stain this thing so thank you very much for watching i hope you liked it if you liked it hit the thumbs up like subscribe and i see you in the next one thank you bye bye